Welcome back guys to another exciting episode of Hina Build Your Ride. Uh, we've got a bit of an old girl here today, a 75 series Troopy um, that we've done a bit of work on and uh, we'll run through the build uh, under the engine bay, a lot of lights around the roof and uh, a installation in the back. So before we do that, let's cue the intro. And Hon is not with us today, so I'm going to run through the installation. He's just a bit tied up at the moment. So I'm going to run through what we've done on here and uh, the ins and outs of some of the good stuff we put in. So with the engine bay, the customer's requested that we put in a, a battery isolator. So if he does uh, not park it up for a while, we can just isolate the, uh, the vehicle with a quick switch off. Uh, cuts powder everywhere and then the batteries won't go flat if he, if he leaves it for a long period of time. Done a, a bit of a tidy up with all the uh, the wiring that was on before that, and we put our touch to it where we put the connection to the rear with the DC hub. So he's got a full insulation in the rear with power distribution correctly rated um, with 6 BNS cable all the way down to his chargers in the back. All this other stuff was already installed. This is the battery I'm telling you about. This is the secondary battery. Uh, so this is the main battery installed in the vehicle. So all the power distribution comes off this. This is a secondary battery that's already been previously installed. That's a lithium powered battery, which is connected just for the jump starting connections and the um, get home safe option that the customer can have if they require, if their alternator does play up as they're going along. Uh, previously installed and we've just tidied up the wiring to that one. As you can see, she's a bit of an old girl, but she still runs really well. And uh, obviously, you know, you can put a million Ks on them and they'll still do the job. Coming through to the back, we've got the rear park view camera, which we're a big fan of. It's got a da inbuilt dash cam in inside it as well. So it records as you're going along and it's got a reversing function. So you can see at the back, just like a rear vision mirror, but with a camera built in so you can just see the back of it, see what's actually behind you as you're driving along or when you're reversing. So now we've had a look at a brief bit in the front. We'll come around to the back and show you the installation. We've been building this one with uh, Odyssey um, installations where they do custom fit outs. So instead of being the, the metal style function one, so, uh, it's got a wood design. 
where everything is uh, wooden cabinets, all laser, laser etched and laser cut. Um, so like things like the bed will slide out for you. And then that's where your mattress goes. Great for storage and things like that. We've got our Klarman uh, outlets here on the, on the unit, all your USBs, accessory outlets, and all your light switches here, which you can add to later, because you've got a couple extra spare ones ready to go for later. We've got our National Lunar fridge here, fridge freezer. Um, great unit there. Um, also built in a custom design and custom panel. So we'll jump up inside. Nice and, nice and fun in here. So on the power distribution side of it, we've got the Victron gauge here for your smart shunt. Got our 240 volt inverter switch, which turns on the inverter on and off. And we've got our power outlets through there as well. The Sirocco fan that we're a big fan of, that's portable, movable unit. Uh, we've got it on a Deutsch connector so the customer can put it where he wants to or above the bed. It's fully swivelable, so it, it can obviously swing down. You can put it to whatever angle you want it to have to and then easily just turn it on and have your fan blowing on you as, as, you, as you require. Um, and then where all the, the real magic uh, lies is actually in the power distribution center. So if we go around to the front there where the best angle is and we can have a look at where everything is mounted in there. Um, I think there's nothing too much in here. These are all space and cabinets. It's got good drawer systems. From Odyssey, they've done a custom installation on these with the drawers. There's a really good drawers, good sturdable drawers that are fully closed themselves. So they've got the pull-in drawers. So once they actually get to a certain, certain way in, they actually do the closure themselves. Great latches, great for storage. There's heaps of storage in this. Uh, storage under the bed, storage in these ca uh, can cabinets. Also other storage compartments. So they've thought of everything where there's no real dead space in this. Um, the customer had this uh, racking already installed, so great again for storage. Um, where you don't have a rooftop tent and you don't have more room, storage is pretty, pretty handy um, where you need it. Also some more drawers here for more storage. So all the all the all the things you need you can just set a bit of storage and a charging station up here if you require and a bit more storage just down here and then you've got a big storage compartment just here as well where you can store all your all your goodies in there so really thought after of everything's got different functions but storage is, is a main one as well jump out and come around we've also got the tables here which are, are really handy And we've got lights here so that we can turn on and have these rear lights working as you as you cooking something up or you're making something or you need that um, and you've got your work lights up here as well so you got full 360 degree lighting um, when you're parked up and you want to see where you're going and um, we also got the national lunar light here so on entry so that's got the different functions where you can turn them on have it an orange or change it to white Really good for um, nighttime reading or just seeing what you're doing when you're plugging something in. Uh, and the great aspect of them is the orange function so that you can get away the, uh, the bugs. Now we'll take you around to where all the, uh, the heart of it is, where the, uh, the good stuff is. Uh, under the driver's seat. Behind, sorry, behind the driver's seat. We've got the heart of the installation where we've got our Amtron battery, the 200 amp hour Amtron battery here. We've got our Victron MPPT regulator um, charger in there as well. That's a 30 amp charger with our solar uh, connection right here for a solar blanket. We've got our Egan uh, DC hub here as well um, where all, all the connections go through to making it simplified 
lot easier and compact as well. Not as messy uh, with wiring going everywhere and really easy to uh, install. And where all the fuses actually are located so that if you see something's wrong, you can just quickly go to the board. It will light up saying uh, a fuse is out or a blown fuse and it will tell you which one to change out and then you can easily access that and just quickly change out the fuse and fix, fix the problem while it's there and uh, simpler as it goes. We've also got the 1200 watt Victron inverter here uh, for the customer. So if they want to plug some things into charge, any, anything they want to run off that, they've got that unit packed away as well. So basically all the distribution is just in here and then your inverter's here and everything's ready to go. The last bit I wanted to show you was all the, the lights that are installed. So we've got the steady lights all around. So you've got uh, full uh, lighting around the roof of it so, so they can see where they're going. And, uh, and one last little one I want to show you is in here we've got installed uh, our water outlets, a solar, another solar charger and an air compressor fitting as well. Um, installed there, really easy to access and hidden away. All right. And this uh, completes the, the Heine Builds Your Ride on the 75 series. I uh, hope you've enjoyed the video. Um, this one definitely gets the ticker of approval of ready to drive anywhere. Um, remember to like and subscribe in the, down below. And uh, thank you for watching this video and look forward to seeing you in the next one.